Hey guys, do it on a dime here. If you've got a really small bathroom, I am so glad you clicked on this video. I'm gonna show you how using less than $30, you can organize your space. And this is secret organizing, so your space isn't gonna feel cluttered. And no, we are not using a plastic storage tower. <laughs> The most used bathroom in our house is our downstairs powder room. I've got a pedestal sink in there and storage is really hard. So unless I wanna keep my toilet paper in the kitchen, which I don't because I have a hard enough time getting people to change the toilet paper roll, I needed a solution that didn't make the space feel cluttered. I went to the hardware store and I mounted a floating shelf above the door. You can get these kits for between 15 and $30. It comes with everything you need and they're really easy to install. So install this in your wall in at least one stud and then the shelf is gonna rest on these. I'm storing toilet paper, air fresheners, extra hand towels. And I mounted it a few inches above the door so it doesn't feel claustrophobic on you when you walk in. The bathroom feels really open and airy but I have all of the extra storage I need and it's not something my kids are gonna take off of a shelf. <laughs> what are you doing here, buddy? There's lots of cute options on Pinterest if you wanna get fancy with some of the moldings or even if you're handy, build your own. If you have a bath shower combo in a very small bathroom and you don't have a lot of space to store items, absolutely look into a shower curtain liner with pockets. The mesh pockets go on the side that doesn't touch the water so everything stays dry and I haven't had a problem with humidity. Store all of those extra items that you don't have a place to put. It's hidden so everything feels clean and open in your bathroom. You can also get smaller versions like this for just a few dollars online. This is gonna go in between your existing shower curtain liner and your shower curtain. And it even comes with the little hooks that you need to install it. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, leave it a thumbs up, and I will keep bringing you small space organizing ideas and innovative solutions on tiny budgets. I'll link everything I mentioned in the description down below, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye. Hey Carson, I think your pants are on backwards. <laughs>